I'm Julie Blanner from the Lifestyle website, julieblanner.com, where I share easy ideas for entertaining, home decor, and recipes. Today, upon request, I am sharing our Under the Stairs reading nook with you. This nook has been so much fun for the girls to hang out in, and it was a previously underutilized space. And you know how much I hate clutter. Well, this right here was the clutter collector. It was really undefined, and so it was a great place to store all the junk when I asked for everyone to clean up. So we decided to make it something really fun, unique, and useful. And that's this little nook right here. makes a fun secret hideout. You really wouldn't realize when you're coming in our home at the foyer just above or walking down the stairs what lies beneath and that's just part of the fun. It's a really great place to read books, cozy up, have fun and play with your stuffed animals or of course even sleep. We here at the Lake Cottage we like to entertain quite a bit and so it can actually sleep one to two more children in a pinch. Now to make this under the stairs nook, it was actually pretty quick and simple. Well, it's because I didn't do it. Chris did. Chris did this for me in about a weekend using existing supplies that we already had in our garage. We just used some leftover plywood and built in the bench area. I've also seen where you can use drawers to build a space, but we wanted to make it A, quick and easy, and B, really inexpensive. We didn't want to spend a lot of money on this project. And so using those leftover supplies and just building it in worked out really well on the budget. Then we had a custom cushion made. Now you can have cushions made. They're intended for RVs and campers and things like that out of memory foam. You just put in your dimensions and they're shipped to you within about a week. So that worked out really well because it was inexpensive and it fit this ill-fitting space. It's actually the same length as a twin mattress, but it's wider. So it's a little on the awkward side. It would not be something we could purchase otherwise, but it was about $100 to have the cushion made. And then, you know I love for slip covers? Well, we had a slip cover made as well. It's made of indoor-outdoor fabric, so it wipes clean with water, but it also is removable so we can wash it if needed. And of course, you have to have pillows and a cozy reading nook. It's a great place to cozy up, kick back, and relax. I really wanted to lighten here, just like a little reading lamp, but we didn't have electricity. So, the solution? Using a plug-in sconce. A plug-in sconce is a really easy way to add lighting to almost any space that doesn't require an electrician. It's so charming. We had it made in brass and it kind of has that little nautical flair to reflect that we are at the lake. And of course, no space is complete without a piece of art. And this frame print is just waves, which is kind of a reflection of the waves just beyond the window outside. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to click subscribe and set alerts so that you never miss a video. I'll be sharing so much more on how you can blend design and function. I look forward to seeing you again soon.